Greetings everyone, the Good Tonight's here and welcome to 2019. So, we survived 2018. It was okay, I guess. It was 2018, now it's 2019. Debated canceling it for 2018.5, but here we are, and we've had several upgrades. So this is our obligatory 2019 video. Beginning of 2019 video, we already did our obligatory 2018 video much earlier, and there's been a lot of changes, particularly the high-speed low-drag approach to our gear. Particularly up here in the cranial region, we've got slimmer, easier magazines from s -Tech that we can quickly re-index, move around freely, and do fun stuff with. We've got s -Tech Kiwis on our belt line as well, so we can carry two handgun mags, which is something I abhorred doing for the longest time, and now they're mostly out of the way. The material's a bit bumpy. It's a bit weird, but now we can actually go from here, we can go left, go right and we do put a bit of our plate carry on our mags but if we're doing this and we need to swap mags at any point we can quite effectively just pull them off to the side swap them out now 17 mags are a wee bit longer but until we can afford proper 19 mags this money is hard to come by i still haven't worked on that nearly as much as i should have been ah Gotta work on reholstering. Gotta stop moving gear around all the time. Got our PTT down here. Our little radio now hangs out to the left. It's nice out of the way. And we just go clicky clicky and we can chat. So, that's cool. We got ammo. Ammo's good. We are going gas blowback. That is the huge thing. So we got our Polar Star. We used it a few games. The hose caught on everything. I hated it. Although I do enjoy Polar Star. Our gas blowback. Mark 18 Mod Zero. Sexy beast here. Has our little tack light that can do stroby if you want to give people epileptic seizures like a dick. Oh, um, we got a red dot sight because you don't need anything else. And our VTAC, fancy little padded sling, version 2, with the improved metal buckles on the inside here. And yeah, we've got our fancy Blue Force gear clips. Yes, clip mounts. So that we can actually clip into these parts of our gun, we can remove the sling if need be. And yeah, we got this little knockoff Magpul one up here in the front. And we've got this set up in the uh, close quarters battle setup. So we're on the back of the um, buffer tube here, not actually on the sling anymore. And we got one right here in front of the magwell, so we can very easily transition left shoulder, pew pew, right shoulder, pew pew, left shoulder, pew pew. Right shoulder, oh, we're actually going to be coming around, so we're not going to bump, we're going to do a full transition. And the way this vertical grip and light set up is I can still activate it right-handed. So we can blind people in close quarters, which is a very nice thing to have. You generally don't want to be using your light in the middle of the night games, because you're going to be very easy to see. But even during the day when it's nice and bright, you come around the corner and you go, oh, there's a guy there, and you're both going to sight on each other. You blind him, and he's going to have a very hard time shooting you. And that's the tactic, and the easiest way to do that is just can the gun off to the left real quick. So, cool little technique, fun little tactic we got there. Other things, we've got our sexy helmet set up, now that we actually got a boom mic going for it, so... The airframe is objectively my favorite helmet of all time right now. We took a piece of extra magic tape, we locked that wire down in the back on those pieces of uh, Velcro. I said magic tape, it's velcro, it's magic tape in Japanese, and the, the very rare chance to use the word magic in a sentence is not going to get missed, so. We've got our ear pro, get that running, yeah, pop this wire free, drop that in here, with a little click, and we can get to the clack. So, ear pro is go, throw our glasses away, we don't need them. Those are for nerds anyway. So we can see clearly. Got protection. Helmet's locked on. Well, not really. I need to put that chin strap. I was wondering why I was moving so much. Hey! It's not just a chin strap, it's a retention system. What the hell is this? Hold on, weird things are happening. I do not approve. Oh, that's our mic mount. Bloop! Hey, we're waiting for a windsock. Because otherwise your mic gets cold little footsies, so boom, we are comfy, our sling moves, so I actually took the uh, 
shoulder padding off in case you notice we're running some HSGI ones. Once I had the sling cut up on it a lot and it was a huge problem for everyone. So what are you doing? That's the little Velcro there. So yeah, we'll work around it. I'm debating the JPC 2.0. It definitely sounds like a fun idea, but it's um, a fun idea if you know what I mean. So we're comfy, we're cozy. I'd rather get LASIK first anyway, so I can see without these inserts. They're not a huge pain, but you know, whatever. Our above the rail mount is still coming in, but right now that works. We'll swap it out. We'll actually put one thing up over here. We'll be nice and comfy. We can see, we can shoot, we can do cool things, and gun goes pew. Like so. I can barely hear it because these are amazing, but I'm sure my downstairs neighbors probably hate me at this point. But hey, that's life. So we can quick transition. We have a Glock 19. We got extra mags. We are ready. Let's see, swap that over. We probably even. Yeah, get that behind us a bit so we can move around. I haven't had too much of a chance to fiddle with it because it's going to swing around everywhere all crazy, but it's better that than other things. For the most part, it's secure. You go, hey, how about you stay right there so I can do things. Pop, 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 pop. We do have a stock interface, so if we run around too crazy, as opposed to at one point, it's not going to hiss in the dick and the jaw, so it could be a lot worse and we still have free aim. And we can climb ladders. That's a cool thing. Kids still do that, right? That's what all the cool kids are doing, climbing the ladders. Yeah, definitely being able to get around corners a lot easier even with the sling going. It's going to be the big thing, so. Lots of upgrades to our overall comfort and niceness. The biggest one being like, oh, let's not lose a tooth. We're just going to take this and we're going to do this real quick. Do do. where's the Velcro? There we go. That's a bit high, isn't it? Ah, Velcro, why? Do do. Okay. Again, to work with that mic is going to be a bit of a pain, ain't it? Ah! Okay, but yeah. Teeth are safe. That's the big thing. Don't lose your teeth. You need them. There's a Velcro end right there. Okay. So yeah, you got these cool, fun little options. What are you doing, Velcro? What are you doing? Yeah, okay, so that's... Get up there. Okay, there. Get that out of the way. Oh my god. Can you stop? Okay, now I'm actually chewing on my microphone. What a time to be alive. Where did it go? Oh my god. Okay, so yeah. Cool things. Do I look good? That's the most important thing. Um, 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 um. This mic tastes funny. God, I'm uncomfortable. It's hot. I probably should have that heater on. Heater, stop. Heater, stop. But yeah, so we got cool things. I like how you can just kind of like whip that up there. It's nice and comfy up to the side. Pound that up a bit. Rain shots. Yeah. So we are comfy boy and we are definitely cool boy. That's the most important part. And we're ready to go. We got our fanny pack. It's full of snacks and pokey bait and beef jerky mags. Gloves off on the side here because we'll probably not want to get shot in the fingers. And yeah, so basically, we're as ready to go as we're going to be. We have access to our grenades. They're not in here right now. i got to fill them with gas and stuff, so that's on the to-do list. Ah, this might taste terrible. I'll probably put some, uh, I don't know, some type of like lollipop coating nonsense on it, so it won't distract me as much. But yeah, we're ready. As ready as we're going to be. I need to be a bit looser. Yeah, just a little bit. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Pop, 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 pop. Okay. Gotta be able to do our gun foo out here, so that's pretty much everything. Urgh. Get that off. It's too hot. It's too hot. Urgh. So, yeah, the ability to GTFO from all this gear is a nice power to have. Let's go ahead, put that back up here. How far? Oh wow, yeah, that goes way up there, doesn't it? Cool. Ah, sweet freedom. Anyway, make sure you practice with all your gear on because this is a pain to move around and do things if you don't practice. That should be horribly obvious right now. Actually, I can make that stock shorter. I'll fix our problem. We don't need the long boy stock right now because we're going to be shooting very, very close quarters. So short stock's probably going to be the way to go. Not short bus, 
It's easy to get confused, I know. You eat one crayon, everyone's like, ah, short bus, ha. Ah. So yeah, that's just the moral of the story there. So we're good, we're comfy, everything's fantastic. Couldn't ask for more as Apple shoulder pads. So yeah, we're good. That's my obligatory video. Hope you enjoyed. It was fun to make. It's really hot. It was hot yesterday. It was cold this morning. It's hot again. That's Okinawa. Anyway, key point of this whole video, the reason we're doing it is because the 29th, we're going to go pew pew. And I know it's Okinawa. It's probably going to rain. But as you can tell, I have gone through exclusive measures to make sure everything is waterproof. I'm good. We can go out in a typhoon, we can still play. Now, finding opposition, maybe not so easy. But yeah, so we're good. We're ready. Got my hands in my pocket because I, uh, certain rules don't apply to me anymore and it's comfy. So yeah, that's all I really got for you guys. One of the fun things that I do have is there's actually only like two gauzes in this little dangler pouch over here. Nothing else, just gauzes, in case someone gets hurt, because, you know, I can't, I don't know what to put in here. I mean, I don't need anything else for airsoft wise. Hell, there's nothing in the backpack. This whole nice, uh, MWR pack, nothing, or Green Mountain Ranger, GMR, nothing in it. It's just comfy. I can fill it with water, I guess. And we should get some training plates. I need some weighted training plates. Someone send me training plates, because, I mean, the soft armor is nice. It's comfy. I'm gonna go T-pose on some nerds. I guess you can T-pose down here too. It's more of the common T-pose. You just kinda like hover over to them. I can't hover. I mean, I've tried. I'm not a wizard. One day, one day I'll just float around T-pose style and tell people their mothers have the gay. The big gay. Terminal gay. Really bad. Don't get that. And yeah, so that's all I got for you guys. So, cheers. Something or another. I'm... I just want to go play, dude. I haven't played in, like, forever. There you go. Shoot something. It's good for you. Builds character. Um, wear a mask. Wear Fool's Your Light, bro. Or not. I mean, your dentist would probably be happier if you don't wear a mask. I mean, that's more money for him. You don't really need your eye, bro. Um, you get cybernetic bionic eyes. Maybe not now. Watch this video in, like, 2025? 2030? Whenever we get cybernetic eyes. Presuming the uh, World War III doesn't kill us all in a nuclear holocaust. So, cheers everyone. IFACs are your friends. And uh, stay hydrated. Um, oh yeah, and also check out Mythic's channel and buy cool gear from him. You didn't pay me to say that. I do what I want. You're not my dad. And, oh yeah, also, if you haven't got your weapons grade waifu patches yet, then uh, you're behind the power curb. And we can't be friends. I'm sorry. It's not me, it's you. You need your weapon grade waifu patches. They're essential. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So, hashtag sorry, not sorry. Cheers, everyone. Enjoy 2019. I'll see you guys on the field, hopefully, or whenever. This new camera tells you that I didn't shave today, and I don't like that. <laughs>